Good afternoon. I'm at the Changnan BTS station, and today I want to show you the sky bridge and the very nice bridge that is crossing uh, Saton Road. So Cheongnamsi is on the dark green BTS line, the Silom line. And this is in the heart of the central business district of Bangkok. Nice musician. Sorry, Hap. Yeah, this is a very modern overpass. I really like this place. And there is a nice uh, bridge that crosses the Saturn uh, Road and brings you to some um, yeah, very nice office buildings. Yeah, so as I said, this is in the heart of the business district. And here you can also uh, disconnect with the BRT, which is a bus line that is running through the, the Rama 3 area, along Rama 3 Road. And the BRT brings you to Talak Blue area, which is on the... Um, yeah, it's Talaklu is actually another station that's on the dark green BTS line. Yeah, I'm here in the middle of the day, so it's not that busy now. Everybody is working. So Yeah, I think this opened about 10 years ago and it's a very popular place for making pictures. I see already a couple of students here that make their, it looks like, like the graduation pictures here. Yeah, so here you have Saturn Road in front, which is one of the main business roads, you could say, in Bangkok. There's many offices here on this road. As I mentioned, many people use this to make cool pictures. Wow. Yeah, it's beautiful with this arch on here on top. Yeah, and if you follow Saturn Road here, then you get to the river, then you get to Sapan Taksin where you have all the river boats. So this here is the W Hotel. Okay. So then down here you have the BRT that I was talking about. So it's a dedicated bus line. It's a 
16 kilometers long and they started operations in 2016 but I just read up that um, a couple of years like two three years ago they were almost closing it down uh, because they didn't have enough uh, ridership and then they decided to continue but with a new it's a new company that is uh, taking care of the service now and the rides are a little bit more expensive yeah very nice example of the modern Bangkok so and then here you go into a mall called the uh, M space CBD hangout promises something good I've never been here before so I'm on the go now so as you can see there's a Virgin Active a very popular gym in Bangkok yeah I guess this is uh, this is one of those food malls as I always say full with the usual suspects but it looks nice because it connects here with a big office building ah this looks cool This building always reminds me, <laughs> I think it's like Star, Star Trek, right? Where they have the Borg and they have their own ship. So let's imagine we're in front of the Borg ship. That's it, man. Let's hope they do not connect us into their community. Yeah, this is all relatively new. I don't know how how long ago they opened this. But I do know obviously the skywalk there, but I've never seen this new office building that connected with it. Yeah, that's just one of these things with Bangkok. You always discover new stuff. And uh, this is also what makes this city very interesting, you know. Let's see where I'm heading now. I really like this glass partition here. It gives a very open view. Well, it's a Saturday and it's a holiday weekend now, so it's definitely not busy. Okay, I hope you guys enjoyed this update. As you can see, we are back in Bangkok again after a nice trip in Phuket and uh, I'm gonna be providing a lot more Bangkok stuff and I'm gonna always try and mix up the traditional the old Bangkok with the new so this definitely is part of the new Bangkok so I hope you enjoyed it and I hope to see you guys in my next video